guys, I'm back with another video today and today is a clothing haul, how exciting. It is from the brand Aritzia as you might have been able to tell by the video title. Uh, but I do have two items from H&M and Forever 21 that I'll throw in at the end. Yes, I have a huge honking pimple. It is like 29 degrees Celsius today, so it's really flipping hot. But I've closed the window so there'll be less background noise and um, I have ice water to keep me cool. If you like hauls, make sure to leave a like on this video and comment down below if you picked up anything recently, clothing-wise, because um, Aritzia did have a big sale. I think it's still going. I don't think it ends till August 19th, so if you want to pick up some cheap goodies, <laughs> well, cheaper goodies, Aritzia is a pretty expensive store to begin with, then you should check out their website, which I will link down below. I'm not affiliated with them, I just like some other clothing. <laughs> So let's start with this piece. <laughs> let's start with one of my favorite pieces, if not my favorite piece from this haul. This is a pink denim jacket that's kind of cropped. Oh, and again, this probably might not be a try on haul because I haven't been feeling too confident with my body recently. So once I lose some weight, maybe I'll do a lookbook because that is a video I've considered doing. This is called the TNA Andino Denim Jacket. It's in the color peony pink I believe and I got it for $40. I think originally it was like 120 or something so it is cropped it doesn't go like all the way to your hips I'd say it goes like like yes I'm wearing orange running shorts with this cute top um, like maybe just below your belly button um, which is a really nice silhouette I think for myself and it's a Beautiful like light bubblegum pink. It's not too salmon-y. It's got these silver button details And this is what the back looks like the back looks like some people like to like iron on patches to these kind of jackets For me, I'll probably leave it alone, but I really love this jacket. It's um, jingly jangly <laughs> And I will be wearing this so much in the fall like it is statement It's not just like a plain blue denim jacket, but it is very cute <laughs> Cute is the only adjective I know. The next item I have to show you is this red Wilfred top. Wilfred is like a brand that Aritzia carries in their boutique. They have lots of different brands, TNA, Wilfred, Babaton, things like that. Um, this top was $15 on sale. I do not remember how much it was originally. It's in the color Lilouette and it's called the Turnasol t-shirt. It's an off the shoulder t-shirt. It's got this like ribbing detail. It's got short sleeves and the band is thick on top with an elastic inside. So it is stretchy for all you broad shouldered gals out there like me. <laughs> I do really like this top. It does look form fitting, but it doesn't like conform to my roles, <laughs> which I really appreciate. The only thing with this top is that sometimes the elastic inside twists um, when you try and put it on. So you have to spend some time like straightening it out. Um, it is fairly comfortable, but I do want to lose a little bit of weight before I really rock this top. It's a gold shirt. <laughs> it is definitely way too hot to wear this next item right now, but this jacket I bought in store. I didn't order this one online, so I don't really remember the name of it. If you know the name of this jacket, you can comment it down below, but it's like a army colored jacket. I think it's in the color Monterey. I might be wrong. It's a long sleeve, like, army style jacket. It's got these like little details on the shoulders with all its colored buttons. Um, the pockets are real. A girl can appreciate that. And it does cinch at the waist. It's got like a little drawstring on the inside that you could cinch the waist in. Or if you want a more loose fit, you can just uncinch it and it'll just have like a straight form down. <laughs> this part made me laugh, but there's actually little holes in the armpit. Can you see that? So if you have sweaty armpits, then you, you've got some ventilation there, girl. <laughs> and it's a very, very um, attractive jacket. Yes, I see myself wearing this like every day in the fall, which I'm excited for because it's hella hot and I'm dying. The shoulders do feel a little bit padded, which I'm not a huge fan of because I already have quite broad shoulders, but it's not so padded that you have like, you know, like, Madonna spiky concert wear shoulders, if you know what I'm saying. But he is a uh, real winner, a real winner. This is a t-shirt from Wilfred called the Adela Top, or the Adela t-shirt. It's in the color oak slash palm pink. And it's a very pale, like paisley 
kind of crop t-shirt. It's not super cropped, which again, I appreciate. And if you look on the inside, it's much more vibrant paisley. But they just sewed it in a way so that the paler side would show through. And it ties in the back with a little knot. This top will slide off your shoulders, like constantly. So make sure you uh, wear something that covers the, the nips or you might have a nip slip. Like wear a thick bralette, my ladies. <laughs> um, I do really like it. I think it's very fashionable. It's probably not super functional. I did wear it um, to the island, like Vancouver Island a, a few weeks ago. And I do think it's a very, a very, very adorable top. I'm trying not to use the word cute. <laughs> it's comfortable, but yeah, the only thing is that it constantly slides off your shoulders. So you gotta either glue them onto your shoulders or <laughs> just be careful uh, when you're wearing it out in public. But it does look nice if you are like a mannequin and you don't move. I keep changing the lighting by <laughs> putting the shirt up to my face. The next item I got is a skirt. I don't actually wear a lot of skirts, but I want to get more into wearing dresses and skirts. So I picked up this dress. What's the skirt? Again, it's called the Primrose Skirt, I believe, in the color Pale Peach. I got it for $14, and it's got this like tulip detail on the bottom. The back doesn't have the tulip. And it's a very thick, stretchy skirt, and it's from their best, uh, their brand, Sunday Best. I got a size medium. I have a huge butt. <laughs> this dress is very pretty, but it does show underwear lines. I don't usually wear a lot of bodycon style clothing items, and I'd never had this problem before, but if you're gonna wear this skirt, you probably wanna wear a thong with it. Otherwise, you're gonna have like, people will be able to see underwear through this skirt. Even though it's so thick, it's so weird. It's just like, it shows all the lumps and bumps underneath of it, underneath it. But it is a very pretty skirt. I can see myself tucking like a loose t-shirt into it um, for a more casual look or like a more fancy top to really dress it up. And it's a nice length too. It's not too short that it's scandalous. <laughs> I do have some really short skirts I'll be showing you in a bit, so yes. Primrose, like the Octopath Traveler character, which I'm really enjoying right now. You should play that game if you uh, haven't played Octopath Traveler. <laughs> the last item from Aritzia that I uh, didn't return <laughs> is this pink, hot little pink number. It is a bodycon dress, also from Sunday Best. This dress is called the Addy Dress, and it's in the color Fuchsia Fusion. Ooh, fancy. It was only 20 bucks, which I thought was a steal. And this dress I feel like would be really good for going out in. <laughs> like it's fun, you can dance in it. Um, I do feel, you know, again, I was saying, I don't feel super confident in my body right now, so I want to wear more loose fitting stuff, but I'm going to lose weight, I'm going to exercise, and then I'm going to rock this baby out on the town. <laughs> it's got a nice, like, heart-shaped neckline there, the back is just straight, it's got that rib detailing again, and the bottom is just a straight line, as you can see. <laughs> it's really pretty. I like it very much. Before I move on to the non Aritzia items, I just wanted to give a few honorable mentions. Sorry if I keep looking down. I have all the names of the dresses on my phone <laughs> or items. So this is the, I'll put a picture here, the Little Moon Agaritum Long Sleeve Top. Um, I got it in the color of Oreo slash Wild. It was a $20 t-shirt. Um, it looks really cute on the model. The model pulls it off really well. But unfortunately, when I put it on, it made me look like a grandma and not in the way that's like grandma chic. It was just like full on grandma. Yeah, I don't mean to offend anyone, but that wasn't the look I was going for. So I did take it back to the store and I got a store credit for it because I think Aritzia doesn't accept returns on sale items, which is kind of silly in my opinion. And then I also picked up this pair of shorts called the TNA Greenway short which I also exchanged for store credit because it looks opaque and black in this picture. On the model, it looks like she ain't showing her underwear, but this pair of shorts is full of holes. Like it's got little holes in its design and you can see everything. That, that model is probably wearing like a dark pair of shorts underneath this pair of shorts to make it look opaque, which I think is very deceiving. Like that's, that's not cool, Aritzia. But yeah, I thought they would be cute, but uh, sadly, they uh, show everything. <laughs> and then lastly, this is another top that I exchanged for store credit. This is the TNA Caballero shirt. 
I got it in the color bleach wash and it was in a size two. These type of oversized items they have in size one, two, three. I got a two because I'm like a medium slash large usually. And um, it was 25 bucks. I used to have a top when I was like in grade eight that looked like this, but it had no sleeves. It was kind of a loose bleach denim. And I really miss that top. It, it kind of made me remember wearing that in grade eight. And um, I hated it. I was drowning in fabric. Like you can make a tent out of that size top. I wonder if I got a size one if it would look better, but the store didn't have any size ones either. So I just ended up getting store credit for it. And now that I'm done pooping all over Aritzia's face, <laughs> I'm going to show you the last two items I got, not from Aritzia. So this is a dress I got from H&M. This is like schoolgirl weeaboo as hell, fulfilling all my otaku dreams type of flared sailor skirt. <laughs> it's like a pale pink, it's got like a diagonal ribbed pattern. And on the bottom is two white stripes sewn onto the back of the bottom. Oh my God, what am I saying? <laughs> it's got a button closure and a zipper for extra security. And it is so cute because it flares out. Like it gives you that little whimsical fairy vibe almost. Fairy schoolgirl vibe. Yes, it's very cute. Uh, I said cute, damn it. <laughs> but it is a little bit short. I do have a big bottom. So sometimes my bottom lifts the back of the skirt more and it's a little more revealing. The front, front lengthwise is okay. When you're sitting, it like rides up a little bit. <laughs> but that's the problem with a lot of skirts, I find. Um, but I do really like the design of this skirt and I got it on sale for 12 bucks. I think if H&M still has them, they've marked it down again to like $5, which is insane. So if you wanna pick up a cute schoolgirl wheel boot, weeaboo of your dream skirt, <laughs> I think it's still available. This dress was a little more expensive. I believe I picked this up for $25 at Forever 21, but I had been looking for a skirt like this forever. This is a white, um, white denim, again, like tennis skirt. It's pleated, it's uh, got a little button and a zipper again. Um, this one's not a clasp button, this one's like a, like a put in the hole button. Wow, English. <laughs> and this um, I got in a large, which is not helping my self-esteem. But the medium was so short that if I walked, I'm sure I would have shown a butt cheek. So I picked up this guy in a large just for the length. I did try on the medium and it did fit, but it was just really freaking short. <laughs> so I'm excited to pull, wear this more. I, I'm, I already have a few like cute fall time outfits I plan to wear with this. I think I'm just gonna pick up a few more like t-shirts and stuff to like make it more casual. Actually, I wanna show you one more thing before I uh, call this haul finished. Literally grab this out of the laundry basket, so don't judge me. But I picked up this beautiful bad boy from Uniqlo. It is a men's um, Shonen Jump 50th anniversary shirt that Uniqlo is doing in collaboration with Shonen Jump. And it's Bakugo from My Hero Academia. <laughs> Boom. He is my explody child. So beautiful. I'm not even caught up with the series, but I am really enjoying it so far. So I'll continue to watch it. And I have worn it a lot recently because I want to rock the exploding boy. <laughs> Anyway, thanks for watching this video. Sorry if it was hella awkward. <laughs> um, and I hope to catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.